The Lonely Crowd, a study of the changing American character, by David Reisman offers a profound exploration of the evolving social dynamics and cultural shifts within American society in the mid-20th century. Reisman, along with co-authors Nathan Glazer and Ruel Denny, presents a sociological analysis that examines how individual behavior and identity are influenced by societal changes, particularly in the context of a growing consumer-oriented culture. Reisman introduces the concept of three distinct character types, the tradition-directed, the inner-directed, and the other-directed individuals. These types represent different modes of social conformity and individual adaptation within society. The tradition-directed person is guided by strong, inherited values and norms passed down through generations. This character type is typical in societies where cultural practices and beliefs are relatively stable and long-standing. Such individuals find their sense of identity and purpose within the framework of established traditions and customs. The inner-directed individual, on the other hand, is shaped by internalized principles and goals instilled during childhood, often by authoritative figures like parents or educators. These individuals navigate their lives by adhering to these internal compasses, which guide their actions and decisions independently of external social pressures. This character type is associated with the rise of industrial societies, where individuals must often operate in environments that demand self-reliance and personal initiative. The other directed individual, the most contemporary type in Reisman's analysis, emerges in societies characterized by rapid change and mass communication. These individuals are highly attuned to the expectations and preferences of others, constantly adjusting their behavior to align with social norms and trends. Unlike the inner directed, who rely on an internal compass, other directed people are guided by the feedback and approval of their peers, making them particularly susceptible to influence from media and popular culture. Reisman argues that the shift from inner directed to other directed character types marks a significant transformation in American society. As the nation moved from a production oriented economy to a consumer oriented one, the values and behaviors of individuals also shifted. The rise of mass media, advertising, and the consumer culture promoted a heightened sensitivity to the opinions and behaviors of others, leading to an increased emphasis on social conformity and the pursuit of social acceptance. This transition has profound implications for individual autonomy and authenticity. The other directed individual, while more adaptable and socially attuned, may struggle with a lack of a stable sense of self. Their identity is often fluid, shaped by external influences rather than internal convictions. This can lead to a sense of alienation or superficiality, as individuals prioritize fitting in over personal fulfillment. Reisman's analysis remains relevant in contemporary society, where the influence of social media and digital communication has further amplified the dynamics he described. The need for social validation and the pressure to conform to popular trends have intensified, making the study's insights even more pertinent in understanding modern American character and identity. The Lonely Crowd is not merely a critique of the evolving American character but also a reflection on the broader implications of these shifts for democracy and social cohesion. As individuals become more other-directed, there is a risk of losing the diversity of thought and independent judgment that are crucial for a healthy, functioning democracy. Reisman's work encourages readers to consider the balance between social conformity and individuality, urging a reflection on how societal changes shape not only personal identities but also the collective character of a nation. In conclusion, The Lonely Crowd offers a nuanced and insightful analysis of the changing American character, highlighting the tension between individual autonomy and social conformity. Reisman's exploration of tradition-directed, inner-directed, and other directed character types provides a valuable framework for understanding the social dynamics that continue to influence American society. His work challenges readers to reflect on the ways in which their identities are shaped by external forces and to consider the broader implications of these changes for society as a whole.